Let's see what went on. Katia doesn't like doing stuff like that. We've been raided. Okay, someone tried to rob us. It was quite a tough group, but we managed to fend them off. Excellent, we've got food now. Um, although I don't like using these food, but... Bruno, where are you, Bruno? You can have food. Wounded and recovering, excellent. And he's no longer sick, but he's hungry. These still haven't bloody come together. Can't make anything. You have food. You're very hungry. Very hungry. Very hungry. Okay. Bruno is tired, so we send him there. Rest. Talk to her. Try and get it out of that depression. Ah, and we've got food. This is good. This is good. We can recover now. Bruno, book. No, need to uh, do these first. That. That gives us four. Oh, please be a trader. Please, please, please be a trader. I don't think so. Who are you? Um. Yes. Yes, we can give him one because Pavle is is recovered just about. I don't think he needs bandages anymore. Uh, we'll give him one. But that's not a trader. Come on. You know. Right. Where were we? You. Go and talk to Bruno. You. Have some more food. We can get them to just hungry. I think we are going to get through this. Okay, she's just hungry now. She can go and have a sleep. Lovely is very hungry. Okay, Bruno. Go and cook. I think if we use one of those. Actually, no, we'll see what Bruno needs. Perhaps these are better for. Um, yeah. Yeah, so they are better for um, keeping us making food. So we'll get Bruno to make four food. And then he can use the canned food. Rightly or wrongly. To fill up the traps. And that's it, I think. Well, I'm pretty sure that's all we can do. Send Marin there just to see if there's anything we can make. Nope. Okay, Bruno, eat. I 
Okay, so he's just hungry now. He can go and sleep. See anything you can do? Turn the radio on again. Going on. Oh dear. Uh, some of our listeners report that the military has been committing acts of violence towards civilians. The spokesman for the military denies. It's not a good situation for us. Having suffered heavy losses, the military retreated to their previous positions and resumed the strategy of avoiding direct confrontation. Movement around the city should once again be possible. That is very, very good for us. It opens up a few buildings that we may not have been able to get to before. And we'll put some music on. Okay. So everyone is basically sorted except Marin. He can just go and sit. And then we just wait. Alright, so the situation has changed quite a bit. Um, we are in a much better situation. We've managed to get everyone back to just being hungry. Pavle is still wounded, but he's only sad, so we'll keep him in bed. Uh, Katia is depressed, but we are going to send her out to scavenge again. Bruno is going to guard, as is Marin. Uh, that should mean that we can fend ourselves. Now, where to go? Ruined Villa. They say some people still live here against all odds. They must have some supplies stocked like canned food and possibly bandages or medicine. They won't want to trade. If we're desperate we could try and steal from them. Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Semi-detached house danger. We're not even going to go there. St Mary's Church is known for its charitable priest Oleg. Alas the church has recently been devastated and Olax's fate is unknown. We can expect piles of rubble, so a shovel could come in handy. A group of armed men are said to occupy the vestry building now. Going there might be dangerous. Oh dear. Warehouse danger, brothel danger, construction site danger, danger. Caution advised. The supermarket is located in. The area remaining under military control, but people are still trying to scavenge it for supplies. We can expect to meet other scavengers there, so it's probably best not to go get in their way. Some doors might still be locked. A crowbar could be handy. I think we'll go there. I think we will go there. So, what do we do to prepare? We are going to take the shovel in case we need it and we are going to take both uh, this crowbar not both crowbars sorry and that's it um, actually it's possible someone might want to trade so I think we'll take these herbs settle and moonshine don't need that many. Yeah. It means we're not going to be able to bring as much back unless, of course, we end up trading. Uh, but hopefully it does mean that we will be able to trade if there is someone there to trade with. Alright. Off we go. Okay. 
Uh oh. Okay, we're not. We're not. Uh oh. Oh, okay, cool. I'm not using my normal approach on this run. I don't think I can handle um, the risk of it. Okay, is he going to be dangerous? Hmm. Order it up. Let's go down here. at a time thing we need to um, grab it before they do it's not really leaving us much stuff is it oh no I don't want to cause trouble I don't know if we should have been faster. Because we're not getting very good stuff, are we? I'm not messing with you. Anything up over this way? I don't think so. Nope. Oh. Let's try there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Certainly don't want to mess with you guys. Faded leaflet with skull and crossbones read. Danger, do not touch unexplored ammunition. Any weapon, ammunition or equipment left behind or unexploded may be booby-trapped. Do not touch anything. Do not risk severe injury or death. Report any such finds to your nearest army outpost. Now, do we believe them? Do we believe them? So far, no, I don't believe them. But that would explain why there is so much ammo. Is there anywhere else in here? Nope. That one. At the time, we've got plenty of time at this stage. Is there a way downstairs? There is. Okay. Now we need to make decisions. Um, What do we leave behind? That. Those. Take that. Now we're not going to break through any of these. Or should we? here.
I think that note was a load of cods. I hope so. We checked that one, didn't we? Yep. Okay. Let's break into this. Keeping an eye on the time. I've revised my 3 a.m. to 3.30. I think 3.30 is safe, even for... Good in here. Excellent. Take that. Drop all that. Take that. Take that. The... Uh, actually, no, we need those parts. We'll leave the herbs behind and come back tomorrow night and get them. Take the food. Cigarettes to keep Bruno happy. What else can we leave that behind? Medicine. Should we leave the crowbar here and pick it up tomorrow night? Yes, with a shovel. What else have we got here that's useful? Roll up cigarette for Bruno. That's that's a pretty good score. That's a pretty good score. Hopefully it's still there when we come back. We'll still keep checking everything. For that very reason, that um, stuff that we can still stack. Now I wish I had done my usual trick. Uh, do we have any? No. Check this place out. And then we'll call it a night, I think. Excellent, this has been really good. Really, really good. Um, Let's leave that. Probably should have left it in the other place. See, this messes up my entire... ...entire process. Because uh, now I can't remember where I left things. Whereas doing it my normal way, I would have it all in one place. But anyway, it's been a good run. Let's return, and hopefully we haven't been raided. We'll make one more visit here and basically go floor to floor checking that we haven't missed anything. That was really good. I think we're gonna gonna get through this. If you've enjoyed this episode of This War of Mine, do hit that like, hit that subscribe, share the video, and do leave me comments. You've been watching Smells Bad Gaming. Thank you very much.